besides transporting you guys from Belize to here and taking you guys around, I ain't sure when the manager isn't here, but the day-to-day -day operations occur. So I ain't sure that the you know, lights stay on, that you guys are fed, that the you know, fuel is in both. That's why you always see me up and down. You know? When I have divers here, I have to pump tanks, all those stuff. When you guys rent gear, I have to ensure that I manage those as well. So it's a lot of flexibility in the job. Mm -hmm. That's about it. Here on the island, we try to control our trash as much as we could. Sometimes we have groups from Ecology Project International. They bring their groups and they do a clean up of the beach. Mm -hmm. So they go oh. with garbage bags, they clean it up, and then they give us the garbage and we take it to the main room to dispose of it. Um, as to the trash that you guys create every day, you know, we try the biodegradable stuff, we throw in a pit at the back and we try to burn minimum stuff as well. Every so often we have a barge that comes in and takes all the old stuff that we have off about and take it to town to recycle or get rid of it. It takes one to start, yeah. right? So if one person does it, then I, I don't see why all of us can't help. But if all of us come together, we could easily create some kind of uh, ecology-friendly type of project, you know, maybe use the biodegradable waste, create a compost bin, stuff like that. Uh, the plastics, try to, use, try to see how we can use them in a recyclable way, stuff, you know, those kind of stuff. Do you think trash pollution affects tourism in Calabash and Belize as a whole? Um, and it's we have. Kind of uh, like I said before, it's part of business. Everyone, uh, they're online, they're looking at these beautiful pictures of white sand beaches, and when they actually come and they see, you know, the bottom here, it's, it's filthy, you know, it, it doesn't look good. And to be in paradise, like you said, we have to do our part, that's about it. We can't stop the pollution from coming in, but at least we can try to collect it, you know, and set the example.